I'm gonna do. What are you gonna do? Burn it, burn the barrel. Above us, so hard. Let me have a look. Wow. <laughs> You're not supposed to eat that. We don't know if it's poisonous or not. Ew, I'm just gonna pull on them. I don't like berries. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to our weekly vlog. Today is the day. I am on holiday at work for the next fortnight. The children are already off school, so they will be they will be off school for the for the whole month of August. And it's the time for us to do our camping trip. And this time in South Wales, it's about about two hours drive from where we live. All of the things are packed up in the boot of a car, and we're ready to to a uh, long drive to where we, we gotta go. The site is a woodland site, so it's got a bit of a secluded site for us, and that's how I that's how I want it to be. Uh, I like I like a little I like a little bit of a tranquilness of the place and the beauty of the place is in the middle of woodlands. So join me as I go in there. Okay. Let's close all the doors. Right, are you ready? Yeah! Okay, set the sat nav to our destination. Hello, Yana. What you're eating? It's a bacon muffin and cheese. Side. Are you excited? Kids, are you excited? Right, we arrive at the woodlands.
Right, this is our campsite. We will be staying here for the next three nights. And that is our tent. I bought that in uh, Go Outdoors for 200 quid and it still serves its purpose. It's about six months old now. What I like in this tent is you can just get through. No bending or stooping down. And it's quite spacious outside. Let me get you inside and show you around. Right, this is just like a living area. And that's where we're gonna put our own gas stoves and things or food and our clothes down here moving forward is a very cozy sleeping area that's our bed there and that's where I slept tonight the kids and my wife will be there it's quite spacious really I think we're alone in the site no one is here and it's quite secluded and uh, very quiet all I heard is some crickets because it's it's already seven seven o'clock in the evening and some wild birds there you go what I like in this site is uh, the owner of the woodland says that we can be able to uh, scavenge some twigs and wood as long as we're not going to cut some trees and this is what we got in here and this is our fire pit this is where we're going to lit up later on and the children will having some marshmallows on fire we they all they all do this every year so uh, they know the drill and at the moment my wife is not here cuz I think they are going down at the car park to, uh, to get some fresh water and this is the woodland side I like it here We got wild horses in the woodlands and they are very tame. They might be used to, to, to all the people down here. That's where we camp. 
and that is our tent for the last two nights tomorrow we're gonna go home and uh, and uh, I'm, I will be still on my annual leave but we're gonna remember this summer really it's a we're very fortunate to have a good weather uh, it rains a little bit it drizzles but it's not that rain not too much and what I like in this place is the beautiful rolling countryside I'll show you what I mean that's beautiful isn't it lovely there's the sheep out there it's a flock of sheep and this is the woodlands The best part of the day is to set up a campfire, a backdrop to our relaxing quiet woodlands. Campfires are great for kids, aside from roasting marshmallows, there's nothing better than finishing a good meal than sitting around the campfire and telling stories before bed. And my kids love it. Okay. That's what I live in. Let me have a look at your marshmallow. Stop looking at me. It looks good and then some blue. <laughs> no. No. Hello Toby, what are you doing mate? Pine cones, would you show it to them? Ooh. What are you going to do with a pine cone? Fire. Put in the fire. And who's doing the fire?
What you gonna do? Burn it, burn it, burn it. But we're still hard. Let me have a look. Wow. You're not supposed to eat that. We don't know if it's poisonous or not. Ew, I'm just gonna pull on that. I don't like berries. Camping can have a positive impact on the entire family. We all know that camping is a fantastic activity, providing hours of enjoyment and a wonderful opportunity to connect with loved ones as well as nature. But that's just a start. Did you know that a whole range of wonderful health benefits resulting from camping? From the physical and mental aids to those who are tailor-made for children, these benefits there's are even more reason why you should spend the night under the stars. There are better ways spending quality time with your children aside from iPads, laptops, and Xbox. Times like this they will cherish and remember forever. As a father, my idea to continuously reconnect to my children is to give them a long-lasting memories, a good happy childhood. Thanks a lot for watching for my weekly blog this week, and I hope we can relate to each other.